accompany a silent film, one does a lot of preparation and you study very carefully the film so you know every little detail of the film and how it fits to the music and by having a live orchestra there it makes like the actors on the, on the screen seem like real live people in the room. This orchestra has always had a history of wanting to be alternative, have alternative ideas for programming, so they don't do what the other orchestras do. They have lots of witty, beautiful ideas. I know them very well, so we, we are good colleagues and workmates. Uh, I've done several things with them and they bring a real enthusiasm to the music. You don't feel a difference of attention between something that's really less familiar to something that is more familiar to the ears. And that energy is very nice to have. It makes the work much easier. For everybody working with an orchestra, it's different. How do you want to use it? But I like playing with string players in particular because of all of this resonance of the strings. The electronics that I make for my violin, every violinist hears the, the, the scraping, the, the harmonics, the overtones of the instrument, but the audience never hears that. So I make software that brings those sounds, those overtones, those harmonics up off the noise floor into audible range. So when you're playing with an orchestra of strings and the strings with the harmonic processing, I think it's an interesting uh, combination. Keine Musik mehr. Es ist derart abstrakt und das hat eine, eine sehr, sehr, sehr besondere Schönheit für mich. Ich denke, wenn sich ein Orchester wie Sinfonietta Basel sich einem solch mutigen Projekt widmet, mit einer solchen Intensität, verdient Respekt und Unterstützung. Ja, ich, ich, ich freue mich, dass ich mit diesem Orchester dieses Stück heute spielen darf. Musik 